So, hey there, y'all. I was in Lexington all weekend celebrating Mom's Weekend with Brecken at UK. And Randy came home Saturday. And there was an Amazon package laying on our front doorstep. Which is, you know, that's not unusual. We get Amazon stuff all the time. What is unusual is it is addressed to Pollux and Maxie. Of course, he sends me a video of this laying on the front porch and he's like, uh, what do we, what do we do about this? I said, just leave it there. I will open it when I get home. And so that's what I'm doing today. I'm going to open this little Amazon surprise and see what's inside. Somebody sent Pollux and Maxie something. I don't know, but let's find out. package what's in your moo what is it mooey oh oh you're stretching to open the package okay let's go get pollux let's go see pollux you got a package look pollux a package every time i come outside pollux is out here with the rooster what is it Huh? You want to see what it is? You want to see what it is, Pox? Guys. Hey. Hello. Come back. Let's see what's in your package. Want to? Is everybody excited? Let's see. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, Minnie, we dropped one. Oh, Pox, what is it? <laughs> It's a dinosaur, Pollux. There's a little gift card. To Pollux and Maxie. Two new additions to the toy box and the wheat. Have fun. Oh, so sweet. I gotta send a thank you note. Oh, so look what it is. This one's for Maxie because it's wee -do -wee -do -wee -do. It's a little alligator. Just like your Christmas one. Oh, you want to take him? Are you gonna put him with the rooster in your wheat? Aww. Look at him, he's already trying to find where the squeaker is. Already! Uh-huh. Oh. You love him, Pollux. Oh, Mama got to cut those tags off, huh? <laughs> Are you trying to rip the tag off? Now, wait a minute, sir. That one's not yours. Oh, what was it? Something going on back there. Ooh. While Pollux ran away. Oh, oh, wait! <laughs> I was going to cut the tags off, Pollux. Let's cut the tags off, shall we? Then you can put him into wheat. It's been a nice day to sunbathe, Moo. Aww. Moo! I have one for the Mooey! No, 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 no! That one's not for you, sir. Hey! <laughs> No, it's Moo. Moo. No, Pollux. Okay, hold on, Mooey. Let me get Pollux's. Okay, Pollux. There's your dinosaur. Mooey, here's your dinosaur. You want to see it? Yeah, it's your dinosaur. Kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> kitty, you want it, Moo? No. <laughs> Let's see what Box is doing. Wait a second, sir. <laughs> That's Maxie's. You go play with yours. You want Moo? Moo? <laughs> Wait a second. Pollock! Come here, Mooey. Here. Yeah, you tell him, Moo. Tell him. You tell him. Mooey, do you want it? Ready, Box? Go get it! Why didn't you go get it? 
because you're standing here because you want this one. You're stealing all your big brother's things. That is too little for you, sir. Well, that is Maxie's. You're the big boy. You don't need a little boy toy. This is a little bitty dinosaur. You got a big boy dinosaur. Yeah. So all Pollux wants to do is play with Maxie's little dinosaur. Got a big dinosaur of his own and he's obsessed with Maxie's little dinosaur. I don't know what we're gonna do about this. Stealing toys from his big brother. Stealing toys from his old big brother. The, and the little big brother. I mean, what is Maxie? He's the little, he's the small, older big brother. How about this? This belongs to the small, older big brother. Mooey. Look here, I have to put this right there beside you. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> what is it, Mooer? Felix, you don't touch that. What is it, Moo? Get it, 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 get it. No. You tell him, Mooey. Moo. Mooey. You want it? Want it? Want it? Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. That is Maxie's. Let me have that. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go give Maxie your toy then. We'll see how he likes that. Come on, Moody. Let's get Pollux's toy. Are you kidding me? Come on, Mooey. Mooey. Beep. Get it, Moo. Get it. Oh my gosh. Rude. Maxie. You take the big one, Mooey. Moo, all you really want is a treat. Oh, wait a minute. You want a treat and the dinosaurs? Let's get slim pickings in here. Sir, you're being greedy today. This is the brand of Pollux's favorite toys, Go Dog. We have had, oh my goodness, roosters. We have three roosters, a pig, several dinosaurs, like, I don't even know how many toys, but Go Dog, it's fantastic. It's available on Amazon, and the boy's secret admirer happens to know this. So she's always sending us sweet little packages full of Go Dog toys. You can see how much Pollux loves toys. Literally, he's obsessed with toys and the squeaker. Um, and so this little, this little dinosaur is going to keep him occupied all day, and I'm sure it's going to end up in the wheat. Guys, are we going to send a thank you note? Let's do it. Let's send one on Amazon. <laughs> oh, he got the little dinosaur. Pollux, you little stinker. Maxie, are you looking for the snake? So this is Pollux's favorite wheat. We have to cut it down every year. It's really starting to take off and the wheat will get about seven or eight feet tall. Pollux loves the wheat. He loves to hide his toys in the wheat. It's about hip high on me. <laughs> But it's growing, like it is growing like crazy. Pollux keeps bringing his toys out to the wheat, hoping that it's tall enough and it gets like filled up enough that he can hide his toys in here. He uses it like his dog cave. He goes in the wheat, he hides, he lays, he watches. It's like his favorite little hangout spot. You know how guys have man caves? Pollux has a Pollux cave and even Maxie likes to go in Pollux's cave. We actually have how many? One, two, three, four, five, six wheats. And they're planted in a zigzag pattern. And when they start to grow, they just all becomes one big bush. But you can, when you get in here, you can crawl in and get in the different wheats. And that's where Pollux likes to hide. Are you kidding me again? Maxie. 
This is like the third time today. Seriously? Good thing you're going to the groomer tomorrow. You're a little green dog. Oh. Maybe now's your chance. You want it? Okay. Well, I'm going to put the little dinosaur up here with the rooster in case, wait a minute, in case somebody changes their mind. Nope, I knew that wouldn't last long. Come on, Mooey, let's go write a thank you note. One, two, we'll write a thank you note. Let's do it, come on. While Pollux is running, we'll write a thank you note. Oh, you're coming with us? Are you gonna help too? I love this feature about Amazon, truly love it. If you send someone a gift, Amazon gives you this little thank you note, put in this code and it sends a thank you note to the sender. And it has all kinds of backgrounds you can choose and graphics and it's super cute. So I'm gonna show you how I send, well, I'm gonna show you how Pollux and Maxie send a thank you note. Well, the neighbors are outside walking their dogs and Maxie's got to tell them about it. But I'm here with Pollux, Maxie's on the couch, and we're going to send a thank you note. When you log on to Amazon, it gives you a code to put in. Just put that in and boop, it pops up. Here's a gift for you. So click to unwrap and view your gift. Oh, see, and it shows the gift that was sent, or one of them at least. You can change the decor. Oh, I like this. Thank you so much for the dinosaurs. Pollux already has his in the wheat and he took Maxie's too. He'll be able to hide them soon enough. Thank you from Pollux and Maxie. And off it goes. Isn't that the funnest thing? I just, Amazon just thinks of everything. Pollux sucks on his toys like a passy. It really does put him in like, like a trance and I, I think, I mean, I don't know if I'm right or wrong, but you all know Pollux's whole adoption story. I'm not going to get into it, but I just think he was taken away from his mom too early, and that's why he loves his toys. He just loves to claim them and suck on them and love them, and I just think it gives him that, like, nurturing thing that he didn't have when he needed it as a newborn. And then there's this one. Maxie, look at this, y'all. <sighs> Grat, or what is this? I mean, what all is happening here, buddy? You are a mess. Why do you go rolling in the grass? Oh, me. Yeah, me. You're just covered in it. And the good news is, Maxie is going to the groomer tomorrow. This is the new groomer that I told you all about in another video. Um, you know, we fired our original groomer, the one we went to for like six years, fired her. So we found a new groomer. She's really close to our house. We've been to her once. The groomer said it was a struggle. Maxie was cantankerous, but she got the job done. Maxie has another appointment tomorrow. Hopefully it'll go better and we can kind of get him looking like a schnauzer again. But if he doesn't quit rolling in the grass every day and picking up all of this like stuff, you can't stop him. He loves to roll in the grass. And I know as soon as we get home from the groomer tomorrow, that's exactly what he's going to do. But, you know, what are you going to do? You let him do it. But we're still going to go get groomed. So that'll be a video. I will be sure to let you know how it's going with the new groomer. So the boys want to say thank you for the dinosaurs to their secret friend, secret admirer. We know who you are. Um, and we just want to say thank you. They love the toys. Alex already has the toys in the weed. He can't wait for the weed to get tall enough. So I'm sure he can take all his toys out there and play in the weed. I'd give it maybe two or three more weeks and, and he should be able to get in there. But thanks for the dinosaurs, Lynn. <laughs> okay, okay, take it.